The media is awash with the news of the vessel off the coast of Port Elizabeth in South Africa and the contents therein. The issue is that the said vessel, which contains a shipment of controlled items that have civilian and military applications on board, did not have a transit permit as required by the South African Non-Proliferation of Weapons of Mass Destruction Act 97 of 1993. According to the national spokesperson of the South African Priority Crimes Unit, the Hawks, Brigadier Hangwani Mulaudzi, a vessel is indeed being detained. That vessel does contain explosives. But despite stories out there in the media, Brigadier Mulaudzi wouldn't confirm to Channel's television if indeed that vessel was destined for Nigeria. Ours is that that information will only be divulged once we have finalized everything. But for now, it remains operational. So I can't speak on behalf of the media. I will be making a very big mistake if I have to say anything which is not authenticated. At the Consulate General in Johannesburg, the Nigerian mission officials were reluctant to give comments as they are yet to receive official reports from the Hawks, which says it's still investigating. We try to ascertain the uh, documentation that was supposed to have been granted. So that investigation is still ongoing as we speak. Um, so until such time, we cannot divulge anything better. An official meeting between the Nigerian mission officials and the security authorities is expected to hold soon, but at the moment, the vessel and its contents remain detained. From Johannesburg, South Africa, Betty DBA Vision News.